spooky, spooky. It is uh, Friday the 13th and uh, ghost and goblins abound. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I can't stop looking at this. This is so incredibly <laughs> cool. Yeah, so uh, the award-winning Halloween pop-up Black Lagoon is in town featuring some hair-raising drinks and dungeon-like decorations. A lot of those here with us today. You never know what haunted ghouls you're going to run into at this bar. So today, we're going to be learning how to make some of their spooky cocktails with Mark Sassy. Welcome. Yeah, thank you for having me. Thank you for bringing <laughs> the vibes. Yeah, uh, Black, absolutely. <laughs> Black Lagoon, currently at 13 different locations around the United States and international, right? Yeah, absolutely. All right. Uh, where can people find it in Seattle? Do they need tickets? Tell us about that. Yeah, so no tickets involved. Uh, it's at Rob Roy. Uh, at Canoe Ventures, we like to double down. So if you need Halloween, you can either go to Rob Roy or Navy Strength where we have Halloween pop-ups. So Great. Yeah. That is yeah, so cool. Yeah, definitely check that out. All right. So what can people expect when they, when they come and experience all the spookiness? Yeah, so the two people who created this, uh, Aaron Hayes and Kelsey Ramage, they're really into macabre and just like yeah. uh, mm -hmm. the dark kind of like goth sort of <laughs> image and so they wanted to have a place that was very inclusive so come as you are you can dress up if you like or you know just as you are right now I yeah would so encourage uh, come and expect yeah, great hospitality so. and really fun drinks yeah and we're gonna learn how to make two of the featured drinks today what's first absolutely so we're gonna get into the book of blood so we have a little bit of absinthe Oh, oh. Yeah, start, start us out, right? Just a little bit. Yeah, though. absolutely. That's not going to be ash. <laughs> Some lime juice. That went off the rails too much. Okay. Yeah, miso falernum. What? Oh, miso falernum. So falernum, uh, basically like ginger, galangal, lime. Oh. It is a... Uh, with a little bit of almonds, it's fantastic. Oh, okay. Mm. And the mixture yeah. is called falernum? Falernum, yeah. Mm. And then a little bit of beet juice. <laughs> beet? Beet, correct. Oh, yeah, that's going to give us some blood. earthiness. <laughs> yeah, Jafar de Piment, it's going to give us a spiciness. Beautiful. And then mezcal. This is, there's a lot of moving parts here. There yeah, are a lot of moving parts, so forgive me for going fast. No, no, you're yeah. fine. And then we have Montelobos mezcal. Mm, yeah. Nice. So it's going to give us a Good nice mezcal. little smokiness. Do, yeah. Wonderful. I'm going to ice this down and shake it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. And then we'll work on the other one. Sound yeah, good? that sounds yeah. great. Yeah. I love Beautiful. it. Do people just absolutely adore getting like the theme cocktails? <laughs> it's been a lot of fun. Yeah. Uh, yeah, just like the theme cocktails have been interesting, <laughs> and this has been one of our more popular ones. It's a delightful margarita variation. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I love that color, it is, too. It is yeah. red, red. And it's nice that it's not artificially dyed red. It's from beet juice. That go. is correct. Yeah, wonderful. wonderful. And so next we're going to move on to... Okay, we're going to try this while you're working flesh. over there. Absolutely. Okay, I got to gotta move fast. Yeah, I know. I know. We're always under time constraints. Oh, this yeah, is really absolutely. Good. Yeah, mm. so we got a little bit of lemon juice in this one. Mm. Mm. Some pomplamousse. Ooh. Yeah, a little bit of Love. grapefruit action mm -hmm. happening. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All and then right. After all. Okay. Gonna bring some herbaceousness to the table. Okay. So is this gonna be light, kinda like an Aperol spritz, or is it a little heavier? Uh loosely, yeah. Mm -hmm. So one thing about this cocktail that we absolutely love <gasps> is that it is a low ABV option. Oh, so we do okay. have non-alcoholic options as well. So you don't need love to it. drink alcohol to come and have a great time. That's great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so a little bit of Lustau. Uh, vermouth rosé and then one of the bases in this is ritual gin which is a non-alcoholic alternative that's awesome. uh, which still has those wonderful like peppery notes that you would find in gin yeah mm -hmm. beautiful so this it does have some alcohol but just a lesser correct okay. yeah the alcoholic content in there is a liqueur mm -hmm. uh, as well as a vermouth mm -hmm. uh, a couple liqueurs excuse me mm -hmm. yeah and then as well as vermouth. Cool. And you guys have performances at Rob Roy this oh. month, right? We do. Yeah, so, pardon me. Yeah. Oh, no. Shake so away. Every, Shake every away. Tuesday we have something called sound sessions. So we have DJs, local DJs, as well as uh, jazz combos that come in to provide wonderful ambiance. Look at the color Look on that. Look at that. Yeah, the color on oh, yeah. these are, is really fun. Wonderful. All righty. What's been some of the, what's been are. like the best costume you've seen someone come in? Something Ooh. really elaborate? Yeah, so I got, I got to throw it out to uh, one of my coworkers actually. So uh, actually like dressing up as uh, the crow. 
<laughs> is uh, the best one that I've seen. Like so, a crow or the crow? No, the crow. Yeah, like okay. Brandon Lee, yeah, the crow. Yeah, yeah. 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 There's yeah. so many so, crows around Seattle. Too. Yeah, he did that for the whole week. <laughs> so good, maybe if yeah. he's watching this, bring it back. Yeah. Oh, that sounds amazing. Mm. Do you always wear this or do you switch yours up? I like to keep it consistent. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Somebody's got to be in charge of, you okay. know, the unruly folks at night. So beautiful. Yeah, that's where I come in. What's your favorite? They're both. This good. one is my favorite. I like this one too, but yeah. I think it's because I like the extra kick. You know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah this has been really so fun. much fun. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for. Yeah, my pleasure. Thank you for today. having us. One more time, tell us where people can find you guys. Yeah, you can find us at Rob Roy uh, and Navy Strength. So Rob Roy, uh, Rob Roy and Navy Strength are both in Belltown. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Kind of hang Sorry, we're playing. Always need a helping point. hand. Uh, that's yeah. very good. Cool. Always here to help. Yeah, very nice. Mark, thank you so yeah. much. Black Lagoon again will be in Seattle until November 4th. We posted more info on our website, box13seattle.com slash studio13live. Wow.